measuring instrument has uh, limitations you must be familiar with the concept of least count in case of hydrogen atom when there is a jump from 10 to 2 there is some lambda when there is a jump from 11 to 2 there is some lambda suppose uh, an instrument can tell the difference in these two lambdas but as we increase the principal quantum number say it is 20 to 2 jump and it is uh, 21 to 2 jump now these lambdas for 20 to 2 and 21 to 2 they are closer the reason being that as one increases the principal quantum number the energy gaps start becoming smaller and smaller and smaller so an instrument will have some limit after a point it won't be able to tell the difference between the two lambdas it won't be able to resolve the lambdas so this question is based on this particular point so here we have n equal to 2 that is fine Balmer series right visible n equal to 2 the higher n that is what we would be interested in so we start with 1 by lambda relationship and in that we put the lower one as 2 you can see it here the lower one is 2 and we are interested in this uh, higher one and after that we would like to get delta lambda so we go for the differential when we go for the differential we would get minus 1 by lambda square delta lambda and so on you will get delta n here so delta lambda and delta n as you are changing lambda here you are changing delta n there now this lambda by delta lambda is uh, of our interest so let's group delta lambda by lambda here keeping 1 by lambda aside so that we can make use of this thing and in place of 1 by lambda let us put this particular expression so minus delta lambda by lambda in place of 1 by lambda we have this thing coming here right side is just like this okay now for the instrument to resolve the lambdas that are close to each other n can be increased in one units so you have 20 then 21 then 22 and so on change in n can be by one unit in place of delta n we put one so and also we take invert endo because that's what is given here lambda by delta lambda so when we take invertendo and put delta n equal to 1 this is what we get now one point is important here if you increase n that is 20 to 2, 21 to 2, 30 to 2 and so on you are increasing the energy gap right which means the photon will be of higher energy 
and if the energy of the photon is higher its frequency is higher its wavelength is smaller so as we increase n delta n is positive we have taken delta n as plus 1 but then delta lambda will be negative so lambda by delta lambda this will be negative so when we take minus here then it will become positive if you look at the question then they have given the magnitude lambda upon delta lambda magnitude this is the magnitude this is not with plus or minus uh, idea this is with mod idea so this positive number is smaller than 8000 and to get the positive number there I have put minus sign because we have sort of differentiated and delta n and delta lambda have minus relationship when one increases the other decreases right side we have n cube by 2 this thing and this fellow is smaller than 8000 so this fellow would be smaller than 8000 and now it is a mathematical inequation and one needs to solve for n and we can do something by which the hit and trial part becomes less so 8000 into 4 into 2 that is 64 and 4 cube is also 64 n cube is there so this is what we get n cube minus 4n less than 40, 40 cube and from this we have an advantage right side is positive and left side we are increasing n 3 4 5 6 7 8 and till we reach 40 left side remains less than 0 and it will obviously be smaller than the right side so till n is 40 we have no problem we don't need to check till 40 we check for 41 and when we check for 41 we find that left side which is 41 cube minus 40 cube left side is much bigger than 4 into 41 and that is why we need to reject that value 41 and values beyond 41 the maximum value of n can be 40 as far as number of lines are concerned then it is like this we have 3 to 2 we have 4 to 2 we have 5 to 2 we have 6 to 2 and so on till 40 to 2 so how many lines do we get 3 to 40 how many numbers are there from 3 to 40 and you find that there are 38 numbers so the answer is 38